percentage of the share of unmanned flying vehicles in the aviation is a common and long-term trend. Gradually, the world's armies are moving from small-sized drones aimed for reconnaissance toward combat flying vehicles. At present, dozens of states want to buy combat drones. For example, South Korea, which first deal with the U.S., failed because the price of drones was too high. But Seoul has not given up the idea of air reconnaissance above North Korea's territory. China has developed its own drone, which is an equivalent of a U.S. vehicle and which is probably intended for experts, according to industry experts. This may push other drone producers to intensify their activities, changing the situation on the global market of arms experts. That was a report from Konstantin Garibov and this and this edition of Outlook. Thank you for joining us. Outlook. Politics. Economics. Culture. A glance from Russia. Coming your way is Russian folkways. If you ask the average Russian person what they associate with Tula, most will say samovar self-boilers and pranic biscuit cakes. And this is fair enough, but the lineup of Tula souvenirs also often features brightly painted figurines of people and animals. 